Wow, I got Freddy's mic. That's kind of cool. We got Freddy's microphone. Faz bear fever. Uh, and it's right in front of that really creepy sound bench and his little guitar wielding sidekick. Hello everybody, my name is Karen, and I'm back in the grave being another episode of Five Nights at Freddy's 2. Now, I know you're probably wondering why I didn't look at everything again and why I'm going from the 1020 challenge. Well, it's because this is another recording I'm actually talking over the gameplay for once. Um, I just started to do these for the last two. The last one was honestly because I was not expecting to actually beat 1020. Um, I went to 2020, I mean 1020 is a joke, trying to see if I could actually beat it because I was having really good RNG. But I decided against that, and the reason I'm recording over this one is because while I was recording the gameplay, or while I was playing, and just messing around trying to get the actual win, I was speaking to someone and I didn't want to interrupt the conversation, so I apologize for that again. But I do hope you enjoy watching what is basically the ending of Five Nights at Freddy's 2. This is it, I have 100% the game, and honestly I'm tempted to go back and play the original Freddy and see if I can beat 420 on that. But I really don't. I, I really don't want to. After all this. I think after honestly just after all these fucking challenges. I don't want to see a Five Nights at Freddy's 3. I don't. I think we've we've hit all we've got. I mean I know there's still a little few holes in the story that we need to figure out. And there's still not 100% of the information there. Which makes me worry that there will in fact be another Five Nights at Freddy's 3. Because... What I noticed in this is a lot of, it was a lot of fun. I did enjoy it when it started off and I saw the new animatronics and stuff. And here's, look at that, Toy Freddy being a bro, just absolutely saving me. But I mean, you can see in the later nights, it boils down to camera 11 and that's all you check. Sometimes you may check the vents, but when it really comes down to it, you're just paying attention to the music box, so. If there's anything in this game that I honestly just did not like, it was the music box. It felt like it's a really tacked on mechanic. The flashlight for Foxy, I guess, but I mean, having the hallway constantly go dark and not be able to flash was also a bit of a pain in the ass. So I'm, I'm not all too worried about that. Um, but as you can see, this is such an easy mode. It's honestly, it's a little bit of RNG, but for the most part, if you're good and you pay attention, you flash your light every once in a while, you should be absolutely golden. No problems whatsoever on this. I died a few times, but honestly, I can only say that maybe one or two out of the five or so attempts I, did, I took were my own fault. One was because the person I was having a conversation with messaged me and alt had me when I was on 3 a.m. I was so ticked. Not really like super raw angry, but it was just like, really? Like I was winning. I had it. That was gonna be it. I was gonna one shot it. I was so happy. Look at that again, Doctor Bun Bun Professor, just cock blocking Professor Bollocks. Really, Doctor Bun Bun, professional cock block. Thank you. I've noticed a lot of the older animatronics have been protecting me. It's kind of cool. I don't know why, but it seems like they always jump in and protect me. So. No, I'm not saying that they're good, but I'm also want to say that they're not actually evil. Not 100% evil. They're actually. What's the word I'm looking for? When you look at certain people, it's all it's all context, okay? Now, well, let's take a war, okay? The side that you're fighting for is obviously gonna be the side that you see as right. We're right. We're fighting to protect our people. Up. Well, they see it as the same way. They're fighting to protect their, you know, their ideals, or they're fighting to protect something. So it, it's all context. What's evil to you might be heroic to someone. Now. You know, in, in this case, you know, they're evil to security guards and adults, they're a danger. But to kids, I don't think they are. I do not think they're a problem for kids. In fact, one thing I said in, or at least in the comments of my old theory video, which by the way, after this video, you know what this means, I will be working hardcore to get the theory video out. There's just a little bit of footage I want to get, and I had it, but I forgot to hit record. I had the purple guy attack me. If I can't get the footage by tomorrow, I'm just going to say screw it, and I'll find, I'll put a link to someone else's, which I really don't want to do. I like to be able to sit in my own thing and be like, no, oh, this is, oh, I got all the footage. I managed to find it all. I will link someone who found Balloon Girl and Shadow Bonnie, because I've never had them spawn ever. But, um, yeah, I'm just going to do a bunch of 10, 20 challenges and just 
die a bunch because there's no way in hell I'm gonna beat it. If I do beat it, I'm gonna show y'all the video. I'm gonna pop it up saying legit. But um, all in all, I'm just happy I finally beat the game 100%. And other thing, if I can't find Shadow Bonnie or to um, sorry, Balloon Girl, then I'll find someone's link. By the way, someone tried to the same person I'm probably gonna link. Um, said that there is an eighth night, which is not true. It's like a debug mode. Everything is black, and you can still move around and do stuff, but you can't actually pay attention. He actually gets to night f a 4 a.m., but it bugs out and says you're on day one, and it actually goes to day six. It's weird, but it's not actually a day. Like, it's not some hidden day in there. If anything, it's just a bug. He managed to click it, but I think what he did is he glitched out the coding, and yeah. So don't buy into, oh, there's an 8th night, because I've seen a ninth night, technically, and I only think it is it's a coding thing. It's got nothing to do with glitches or secret hidden, it, it's just how the game works. It's not a anything special, no offense. But I'm hoping I get the footage, because if I can't, I'll, I'll leave a link so everyone can see it. Because the only footage I don't have right now is Shadow Bonnie, Balloon Girl, and I forgot to record when Purple Guy attacked me, so... All in all, pretty good track record, but I'm going to talk to Kairos tomorrow. Hopefully, bounce some ideas with her, because she really opened my eyes. And I'm kind of sad I didn't write down what she told me when we went over, because that was a long time ago, at least maybe a week ago. So I'm going to discuss theories with her. I might actually pop up on the page and ask y'all your theories, because I'll be off early tomorrow. I'll be off at 3.30. So, as you can see, we're at 5 a.m., though. We're, we're, we're running down what I want to do in the new theory videos I'm gonna start off with my own theories what I think what I've seen post my own footage and stuff I've noticed and then I'm gonna go and post what other people have thought and debunk it or agree with it or go about it that way because I think that's be the best way instead of doing one personal video and then doing another theory video because I already have, this is the 19th Friday video I really want it to be done because I still have a secret Friday video I want to work on and I haven't done any work on that as if from Larry so we gotta do that but anyway, it's coming up to winding down. My heart is pounding. Will I win? Will I do it? Of course I will. It's a very short video, so you know what that means. And the entire time, honestly, the biggest thing I was afraid of was Golden Freddy. But anyway, that is that. That's uh, that's the final challenge complete. So with that, though, I'm going to go ahead and pop in, see what we got, and I will be back in one second. All right, welcome back. All right, so just to show you all, this is 420. New and Shiny, Double Trouble, Night of Misfits, Foxy Foxy, Ladies Night, Freddy Circus, Cupcake Challenge, Fazbear Fever, and Golden Freddy. This is the only one I was not able to do legit, but honestly, I don't care. I got it done. I didn't cheat. I just, I used all in-game stuff. So we're going to go find out what the last thing we get is. And of course, y'all can, if you want, decide. Just go and bet amongst yourselves on how fast it'll take the marionette to kill me. All right, let's see what we got. Is it worth? Was it worth it? I don't know. We have. We got a demonic, and very condescending cupcake. And oh, fuck you. What do you? So these are all the creepers right here. We got a. We got ourselves a full, full table. One thing I never did get either though was in this room. This is considered a BB, and apparently he can actually pop out. Wow, that was fast. Apparently he can actually move off the wall and he can move into the building. No fucking way. Oh my God, if I see the purple guy right now, I will spaz the hell out. Okay, no purple guy in there. You gotta be careful, because if you don't follow him long enough, okay, that's, fuck. If you're not following him for enough time, he actually ends up despawning and you end up getting kicked from the game. So There he is! Holy shit, I got him! Oh my god, I got him! Holy shit, I got him! Oh my god! I oh my god, sorry about that. I the, it crashes the game. That's why I was freaking the fuck out, because I was recording it. I actually got that fucker on foot on film. That was the last bit of footage I needed to do the theory video. Now the only thing I need right now is Shadow Bonnie and um, what's it called? Shadow Bonnie and Balloon Girl. So, you know what? Just as a, just as a quick thing since I got that, I'm gonna do a quick Golden Freddy for shits and giggles because, oh my fucking god, the chances of finding the purple guy are so unbelievably rare. And the fact that I got it while looking at the, oh my god, I am just so happy right now. Oh my god, that is so amazing that I got that. I'm probably gonna die here. 
and it's gonna be super, super loud because I'm using my regular keyboard. Oh my god, if I could find Blue Girl or fucking Shadow Bunny right now, I would freak the hell out. Okay, never mind. Yeah, so that was my. Yeah, that was my Golden Freddy attempt. I wish I knew a way to summon Golden, like Bonnie, and, or one of them. I just don't know how to do it. Maybe put on BB at. Maybe put maybe we should put BB to twenty and see if that pops her out. We'll just put full around the rest. This is was a really yeah, since was a really short short video. I'm gonna fuck around a little bit on, with BB at twenty. Uh, what I want to do too is I want to show off all the death animations. So I'm gonna do that as my next video is be the theory video, and I'm gonna do a very short video just showing off all the possible death animations and whatnot. So. I want to find him leaving too. I gotta go back through all my footage and try to see if he actually does leave. I know he does. I've seen it happen. But I want to see if I've ever been lucky enough to actually see that happen. Hmm. I wonder who could be coming through the vent. Who could that be coming through the vent? Could it be the balloon boy? So nothing yet. See, I've watched a lot of footage too, and it doesn't seem to pop up. Shadow Bonnie just seems to be 100% random too. I wish he showed up in other areas as well, but he doesn't seem to. It's kind of weird that you can see Mangle in all of them, isn't it? I mean, Mangle's right there. Yes, there's no way. I don't think I'm gonna get him to pop up, unfortunately. It's a damn shame. I wish I knew how to summon Shadow Bonnie. I mean, I've seen so many people do it, but I haven't been able to do it myself. I'm just gonna fool around and look at some stuff. Maybe I'll just let him get in the room anyway. I'm not really worried about it. Yeah, hi, buddy. Yeah, see those videos here, she cuts off your light. Look at that satanic little son of a bitch. I really wish, yeah, he cuts off all your lights too. I see that was something I didn't know. I wonder if you can get the, wow, he killed me quick. Oh well, so it looks like I'll be linking to Shadow Bonnie and Balloon Girl, which is unfortunate, I was hoping to get it myself, but the fact that I got the Brobo guy is still got my heart racing. I am so excited. But anyway, with that, I do believe it's good as time to go ahead and end the video. My next video I'm going to put out after this is going to be the all... I'm going to show all the death animations possible from all the animatronics. And, well, and all the ones that are possible. And then I'll be doing the theory video as soon as they possibly get. I can and get it all set up and get it all edited. So it may take me a little longer. But I will be doing the theory video now 100%. I have no other excuses. I'm, I have 100% the game. So anyway, I'm headed to the grave. Thank you all so much for watching. Welcome to town, everyone.